Imagine making a phone call without a SIM card, no airtime needed, no mobile network required. This isn't science fiction, this is the reality created by Simon Petrus, a 29-year-old inventor from Namibia. Simon has crafted a device that redefines communication, particularly in areas starved of connectivity. His invention holds the potential to revolutionize how we connect, especially in rural communities across Africa. With this groundbreaking technology, Simon is bridging the digital divide and bringing hope to underserved regions. Simon's journey began in a small Namibian town. Resources were scarce, opportunity seemed even scarcer, yet Simon possessed an unyielding curiosity and a knack for tinkering. He would spend hours disassembling old radios, fascinated by their components. He dreamed of building something new, something revolutionary. Using scraps and discarded electronics, he began piecing together his vision. His workshop wasn't a gleaming laboratory, but a humble corner of his home, brimming with ingenuity. Growing up Simon faced many challenges, walking miles to school, he was determined to learn. Despite the hardships his passion for knowledge never waned. Simon's invention utilizes radio frequencies to transmit and receive signals. Unlike conventional mobile phones reliant on extensive network infrastructure, his device operates independently. It bypasses the need for SIM cards and cellular towers. The phone acts as a two-way radio, transmitting and receiving audio signals over a specific radio frequency. This ingenious workaround allows communication across significant distances, unimpeded by the limitations of traditional networks. By leveraging specific radio frequencies, Simon's device ensures clear and reliable communication, even in remote areas. Simon's path to invention was paved with challenges. Financial constraints and limited access to materials were constant obstacles. Undeterred, he persevered, fueled by his unwavering belief. His talent couldn't be contained within his small town, he set his sights on a national science fair, a platform to showcase his creation to the world. His invention, a testament to his dedication, earned him first place, captivating judges and attendees alike. Simon faced numerous setbacks, from broken circuits to failed prototypes but he sought guidance and kept refining his work. His resilience and support from his community played a crucial role in his success. Section 5. Unveiling the Innovation the phone itself is a marvel of resourcefulness. Housed within a sturdy, hand-built casing are the circuits and components that defy expectations. A simple microphone captures the user's voice, converting it into electrical signals. These signals are then modulated and transmitted as radio waves via an antenna. On the receiving end, the process is reversed, the radio waves converted back into audible sound. Despite its rudimentary appearance, the phone is a powerful symbol of innovation born out of necessity. The public and experts alike are astounded by this groundbreaking invention, recognizing its potential to revolutionize communication. Section 6. From Doubt to Astonishment News of Simon's invention spread beyond his small town. Engineers and tech experts initially reacted with skepticism. A phone operating without a SIM card seemed implausible. However, their doubts transformed into astonishment as they witnessed the device firsthand. The simplicity of its design, coupled with its functionality, challenged conventional thinking. Simon's invention wasn't just a technological marvel, it was a beacon of ingenuity, demonstrating that groundbreaking solutions could emerge from unexpected corners of the world. Testimonials from tech experts highlighted the revolutionary impact of Simon's creation. Section 7. Bridging the Connectivity Gap The implications of Simon's invention are particularly profound for rural Africa. Vast swaths of the continent remain unconnected, deprived of access to communication infrastructure. Mobile networks are often unreliable or non-existent, and airtime is prohibitively expensive for many. Simon's phone offers a lifeline, a way to bridge the connectivity gap. It empowers communities, enabling them to connect with each other and access vital information. Beyond communication it opens doors to education, healthcare, and economic opportunities, transforming lives. Section 8. A Legacy of Empowerment Simon's story is a testament to the power of human ingenuity, proving that innovation knows no boundaries. He is an inspiration to aspiring inventors, particularly those in marginalized communities. His journey underscores that with dedication and unwavering belief, even the seemingly impossible can be achieved. Simon's legacy transcends the invention itself, it lies in the hope and empowerment it ignites in others. His story has sparked a movement, encouraging countless individuals to pursue their dreams and innovate for a better future. Section 9. Join the Movement. Simon's story is a call to action. It's a reminder that we have a responsibility to nurture talent wherever it may reside. 
By supporting African innovation, we unlock a wellspring of creativity and ingenuity with the potential to address some of the world's most pressing challenges. Let us champion the next generation of Simon Petruses, empowering them to transform their communities and the world. Support African innovation by sharing stories, investing in startups, and mentoring young talent. Together, we can make a difference.